So children, we studied about least count of a Venn calipers. So now we need to know how we measure with the help of a vernier scale. So you can see here use of vernier, cal vernier scale, figure 1.2 measurement with vernier scale. So what are we doing here? They have fixed a rod uh, in the jaw. See the figure 1.3. These are two movable jaws. In between that we have to fix whatever we want to uh, measure. Okay. Now come to figure 1.2. So when they have fixed a small rod here. So see the main scale is measuring 1.2. Okay, but the rod is still a little more than that, more than 1.2. But the main scale cannot measure that small distance that is equal to the distance AB. Okay, so what do we do? We write somewhere that the main scale reading is 1.2 and then we need to measure the distance AB. What do we do for that? We just see which division of vernier scale coincides with any division of main scale so you can see see the vernier scale the first second and third fourth division first second third fourth fourth division coincides with some division of main scale okay so we'll write that fourth division measure uh, coincides with main scale see here can you just see this below figure uh, below the equation 1.3 see in figure 1.2 the main scale reading is 1.2 centimeter and fourth division of vernier scale coincides with the main scale division and so the length a b is 4 multiplied by 0 0.01 centimeter what is 0 0.01 centimeter it is the least count so we multiplied the coinciding division with the least count okay Hence, the length of rod is main scale reading plus vernier scale reading, which gives us 1.24 centimeter. So, what we have done? See equation 1.3. This is the way to measure anything. Length AB can be uh, calculated by the P. P is the coinciding division multiplied by least count, and total reading is main scale reading plus vernier reading. Okay, vernier reading is the coinciding division multiplied by the least count. So, children, this is something new for you. Don't panic, just read two or three times. I have explained you, just go through the videos, and you will definitely understand these things. It is not so difficult, but new to you, so you may find it a little uh, difficult to understand. You know, so just read two or three times, and it will be very much clear to you all that's all for today i'll be sending you the images too okay